PSA to liberal voters, you can change your mind. This is a message to all people across Canada who have been voting for and supporting Justin Trudeau and the Liberal government. Even if you have publicly defended this government to friends or family, or you've done so online, you can change your mind. It's fine. Our country at this point needs a new direction. Here's just one more example. Justin Trudeau was asked today about the next federal election. Here's what he said. For the Prime Minister, uh, there's for sure going to be a federal election within the next year and a half. Um, to what extent is Nunavut a riding that you look at as one you'd want to win back to survive another federal election? Well, I think Canadians, not just in Nunavut, but right across the country, are going to have a really important choice coming up in the next election. Do we want to continue to fight climate change? Do we want to still uh, continue to look at uh, responsible partnerships, uh, working together to solve big issues? Do we want to continue to work towards reconciliation as an explicit goal and a journey that Canada's on? Those are the kinds of questions people are going to have, have to ask themselves in the next election because the Conservative Party under Pierre Polyev has made it very, very clear that they want to take Canada backwards in all those ways and more. Uh, and I look forward to having these conversations with Canadians in Nunavut and right across the country. Uh, but for now and for the next uh, year and a half plus, we have a lot of work to do and we're going to keep rolling up our sleeves and doing it together. Now, for the people who support and continue to vote for Trudeau and are perhaps planning on voting for him again, do you really think these are the most important issues facing Canada? How about growing the economy, maybe, or the massive housing crisis we have? Or does Justin Trudeau's answer reflect the issues you have in mind when you vote for and support Trudeau? Because I will just be blunt about it. Justin Trudeau's answer here is absolutely pathetic. This is not an answer aimed at improving the lives of working class and ordinary Canadians. This is an answer that panders to the wealthy and elite class of people who can focus on climate change now that their other needs and wants in life have been met. The average home in Canada is over $650,000 and you no longer are getting rock bottom interest rates we're getting for much of the last decade. Statistically, most Canadians and therefore most Trudeau supporters do not come even close to affording that. I don't mean this to sound condescending, but for those who continue to plan to vote for Trudeau, are you okay with being a lifelong renter as long as you think your government is combating climate change? If you're watching this and you are a Trudeau supporter, please let me know your thoughts in the comment section below.